In this quick video, I'll show you how I made some heavy duty shelf brackets. I'm using them for timber storage, but they can be used for all sorts of things and they're really easy to make. I have lots of offcuts of 2x3s from building a wall recently, which I'm going to be using for this. This is just construction timber, 63 by 38 millimeters, and it's really cheap to buy. It's usually three or four pounds for a 2.4 meter length. I measured and marked 250 millimeters in length, and I offered that mark up to my miter saw blade, and then I put a hand screw clamp onto the fence so that I could make consistent cuts to all of the bits of wood that I had. I added some wood glue to the end of one of the pieces and held two pieces together in an L shape to form a butt joint and then I drilled pilot holes and added some 70mm screws. Then I marked up where to drill some holes which will later be used for securing the brackets to the wall and I want the screw holes to line up just so that they look neat and tidy. I drilled three holes here and for the hole at the top I actually drilled that through from the back rather than the front just for easier access with the drill. Next I grabbed some scraps of plywood. The pieces I have here are 12mm thick. I traced around the brackets onto the plywood and then I joined the two front points with a straight line and I managed to fit two onto this piece here. I cut the shapes at the bandsaw. I could then add glue to where the L-shaped pieces would sit and start assembling the brackets. These plywood braces are going to be what makes them really, really strong and heavy duty. And I secured the plywood braces with a few screws. I did a little bit of light hand sanding to the edges of the plywood and then to tidy these up I applied some green spray paint just to hide imperfections because I'm using scrap materials here. These don't need to look brilliant, they're not going to be in my house, they just need to hold some timber in the workshop so I wasn't too fussy about making them look perfect. I attached the first bracket through the wall cladding into the upright studs in the wall using some 100mm screws. And I'm using an extension bit in my impact driver which makes this a lot easier. I offered up another bracket and balanced a long piece of wood on there and then I can use my spirit level to get the brackets positioned level with one another. Then I added another bit of wood on top to help me to position another bracket in the centre so that it was supporting the wood. I wouldn't feel comfortable calling these brackets heavy duty, unless of course I did a hang test, so here it is. That's it for this one, I hope you found this helpful. Please subscribe to my channel for more weekly woodworking videos. If you'd like to receive early access to my videos, exclusive content, free plans and cut lists and a name credit at the end of my videos, you can support the channel on Patreon and there'll be a link to that in the description box below. Thank you for watching.